guys, it's Brittany and I'm back at my horror hotel set. Like, I'm so happy right now. <laughs> so I hope you guys had an amazing Christmas. I'm so sad that it's over. It's just, it's such a build up and then it's over in a day and then it's just like, oh my God, like all of that preparation, it's just, then it's over and it's gone. It's like all depressing because I'm counting down till next Christmas because I love Christmas so much. And I'm so sad that I'm not filming in front of my set. I'm looking at it right now, it's over there. But anyways, I'm so excited to be back in front of the set. I'm super excited for my regular videos. So starting off with my regular videos, I wanted to do a haunted doll video. So this is a brand new doll. I've never mentioned her in my life. I actually recently heard about her back in October and her name is Caroline and she's a very haunted doll. Well, she used to be. Apparently the last time anyone has really ever heard from Caroline and the owner of Caroline was kind of around 2004. So it's been quite some time and guys, this doll, she looks so creepy. I don't know what it is, like some of the dolls that I've made videos about on my channel, like some of them don't really look creepy, they look so innocent, but Caroline, she does look innocent, but she also looks terrifying, well not terrifying, that's like a whole different word to use, but she's just like, there's a difference between creepy and terrifying, and sometimes creepy can be a lot scarier than terrifying. So anyways, originally Caroline came from this antique shop in Salem, Massachusetts. And of course, over the years, Caroline has had many owners. They've all taken really good care of her and just really creepy stuff has happened with these owners and Caroline, just like every other story that you know includes a haunted doll on my channel. There's always multiple owners and just weird stuff happens to them. Now the scariest thing about Caroline, and this is just, <laughs> this is so scary. I don't know why I'm sitting like this and stuff. It's just, Caroline freaks me out. I'm just being honest. She actually freaks me out. But a lot of people believe that Caroline is haunted by three different spirits. And these three different spirits, they fight over who wants to control Caroline. That is what is believed. And that's absolutely terrifying. Another really creepy thing that Caroline has done with her owners is if you hold her close, apparently she will whisper in your ear. So one of the owners, they said when they were holding Caroline, she whispered in his ear make it you. Apparently he thought, well he took it as good luck. Like she was saying to him, good luck. Make it you, good luck. So that is, you know, some people may look at that like, okay, well she seems like she's nice, but it's still really creepy. So the thing is with Caroline is she doesn't threaten or hurt anybody. She never has. So I think that's kind of what makes her creepy is because you expect her to kind of you expect her to threaten people and to hurt people. If it's a haunted doll, that's kind of what people expect. So that's what kind of makes her a lot creepier, <laughs> at least to me. And you don't know what she's really thinking, what those three spirits, if that is true, there's three spirits that are, you know, haunting her and they fight over who takes control over Caroline. So you just don't know what's really, what's really going on <laughs> in there. So I think that's what's really terrifying. I feel like I've said terrifying so many times in this video, I apologize. The Caroline does like to move around objects. She also likes to hide things in some really odd places. There's been candles that have been found in ovens. She's put pens in weird places. Like she just likes to move around a lot of things. There's been books that have been found behind a bookshelf. So the last time that people really heard from Caroline was around 2004 when paranormal investigators were investigating Caroline. Her last owner did die in 2006 and the activity, like the haunted activity has kind of died down a bit. She doesn't really do what she used to do, but that was back then. Nobody has really caught up with her since then, or maybe they have, they just haven't made it public. So who really knows? It's a very interesting doll and story, especially with the three spirits. Well, a lot of people think that there are three spirits in Caroline, so that's really creepy. So I hope you guys enjoyed this haunted doll video, and now we're gonna get back into my advent calendar, like I told you guys. 
So I have it here. So now we are counting down till the new year. So you guys know, I want to know if Kylo Ren is in here. So I'm on the side for New Year's because this is all like the Christmas side and it's a Christmas and New Year's advent calendar. So since I only upload three times a week, it's not like I can upload or it's not like I can open a door every day on my channel. So I'm gonna upload a few today. Not upload, why do I keep saying that? I'm gonna open a few today. It's so freaking hard to open. Okay, yeah, you guys, I got Darth Vader. I think it's the same as this side. Let me upload another one. Upload, why do I keep saying upload? Open, my mind's been everywhere, holy crap. I don't know. R2D2. <laughs> so these ones are the ones that I opened today. I'm gonna save these for my upcoming videos and then the Happy New Year one I will open when it's the new year. But yeah, he's definitely not in this calendar. Sorry that I made like such a big deal about this advent calendar. I just love it and I just thought Kylo would be in it because he's on the cover, but he's not. Whatever. <laughs> but anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. As always, you rock my world in the song lyrics of Michael Jackson. I hope you enjoyed my first video back to regular Brady 44. My Mothman video is going to be uploaded this Friday. And I'm so excited to show you guys that because you guys know me and the Mothman. Like, Anyways, I'll get more into it because I feel like I've been giving like little snippets of it throughout like December being like, oh my god, my Mothman video is coming. I'm just super excited, so I can't wait to show you guys. But anyways, I will end this video now. So thank you so much for watching. Like I said, as always, you rock my world and the song lyrics to Michael Jackson. Hashtag team Brady44. Hashtag Barilla Renz. Hey! <sighs> And I was going to do my other hashtag, but it doesn't exist anymore. <laughs> and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.